Canada, the second largest country in the world, spans an impressive 3.85 million square miles, 9.98 million square kilometers. To visualize its sheer size, imagine combining the entire United States and Mexico. Canada still surpasses them. This vastness is mirrored by its diverse landscapes, towering mountain ranges, expansive prairies, dense boreal forests, Arctic tundra, and countless freshwater lakes. Bordering the United States to the south and stretching northward to the Arctic Circle, Canada is surrounded by the Atlantic Ocean to the east, the Pacific Ocean to the west, and the Arctic Ocean to the north. This incredible geographical diversity sets the stage for discoveries that continue to captivate scientists and explorers alike. Though smaller in population compared to its neighbor, the United States, Canada's expansive wilderness and rich ecosystems offer fertile ground for some of the most remarkable recent discoveries. From ancient fossils and prehistoric art to groundbreaking advances in glaciology and marine biology, Canada is revealing secrets that are reshaping our understanding of nature, history, and life itself. The discovery of giant prehistoric petroglyphs in British Columbia. In the remote forests of British Columbia, researchers recently uncovered a series of massive petroglyphs, ancient rock carvings depicting figures of animals, humans, and abstract symbols. These carvings are believed to be over 2,500 years old, providing a glimpse into the culture and spiritual practices of early indigenous peoples. Much like the ancient Puebloan petroglyphs found in places like New Mexico and Arizona in the USA, these Canadian carvings offer a tangible connection to a time long past. However, British Columbia's petroglyphs stand out for their size and the sheer number of intricate carvings, some of which are as large as a person. These discoveries hint at a sophisticated culture that communicated stories, rituals, and knowledge through art etched into stone. What makes this even more fascinating is the use of LiDAR technology to detect these petroglyphs beneath dense forest canopies, a method similar to that used to uncover lost cities in the United States. This technology is helping archaeologists map out sites without disturbing the landscape, ensuring these historical treasures remain preserved for future generations. The fossilized forest beneath the Yukon permafrost in Canada's Yukon Territory Scientists made an astonishing discovery of a fossilized forest preserved beneath layers of permafrost. This ancient forest, dating back to the Pliocene epoch about 5 million years ago, reveals a time when the Arctic region was warmer and teeming with life. The trees, remarkably well-preserved, include species like spruce and pine, providing insights into how climate changes have shaped the region over millennia. This discovery echoes fossilized finds in places like Nevada's petrified forest and Alaska's permafrost regions in the USA. However, the Yukon Forest's unique preservation in ice offers scientists a rare opportunity to study ancient plant life in near-perfect condition. These findings are crucial for understanding how current climate change may impact northern ecosystems. As the thawing permafrost threatens to release trapped carbon into the atmosphere, the hidden marine wonderland of the Northeast Pacific Seamounts. Beneath the cold waters off Canada's British Columbia coast, researchers have mapped previously unknown seamounts, underwater mountains formed by volcanic activity. These seamounts are covered in thriving ecosystems, hosting rare species of corals, sponges, and fish. This marine wonderland has drawn comparisons to the underwater habitats of the California coast and the Hawaiian archipelago in the USA. What sets Canada's seamounts apart is their sheer biodiversity and pristine condition. These hidden underwater peaks provide vital habitats for deep sea species that are yet to be fully understood. Scientists are excited about the potential for discovering new species, some of which may hold clues to developing medical and biotechnological innovations. Protecting these fragile ecosystems has become a priority as they offer a glimpse into the largely unexplored deep ocean. The potential ancient meteor, the potential ancient meteor beck. In a sudden turn of events, a massive circular depression recently identified in Cote Nor region by a Canadian Joel Lapointe, who made the discovery
geophysicist Pierre Rochette analyzed samples from the site and for con minerals, which suggests this formation could be an ancient meteorite crater. If confirmed, this discovery would add to the 31 known impures in Canada, providing a new window into Earth 3. This find adds another layer to Canada's already rich history, logical phenomena, and reflects the country's vast, often awesome. In the United States, similar meteor crates have been studied, such as the meteor in Arizona. But the Patil crater in Quebec offers a chance to study a formation that has remained millennia. The assessment of naphthenic acids in Alans. In Alberta, a groundbreaking decision by the Canadian government 2024 took a significant step in science. The government agreed to evaluate the toxicity of naphthenic acids found in the oil sand tailings ponds, the byproducts of human extraction. The tailings ponds, vast artificial reservoirs containing a mixture of water, sand, clay, residual oil, have been a subject of environmental decades. Naphthenic acids, a group of complex organic compounds, are known for their persistence in the environment and potential toxicity to aquatic systems. The decision to conduct this comprehensive evaluation came under mounting pressure from environmental organizations, scientists, and indigenous communities living downstream of the oil nations. Communities along the Athabasca River have long voiced concerns about the contamination of their drinking water, fisheries, and Recent studies have suggested that exposure to naphthenic acids may cause acid effects in fish, amphibians, even mammals. These compounds have been linked to disruptions in reproduction, development, and system function, raising alarms about the long-term impact on both wildlife and human health. This assessment aims to determine the full extent of naphthenic acids toxicity and to explore potential methods for reducing their concentration Innovative approaches being considered include bio techniques, where microbes are used to break down whole substances, and advanced filtration systems that purify water before it is released to the environment. These solutions, if successful, could revolutionize how oil sands operations manage their print. The evaluation in Alberta is particularly timely as similar challenges are being faced. In regions like Texas and California, oil extraction processes also generate byproducts that can pollute lives. The research into mitigating naphthenic acids in Canada could provide valuable insights for American industries grappling with similar issues. This initiative underscores Canada's commitment to balancing industrial growth with stewardship. Alberta's oil sands are a major driver in economy, but the long-term sustainability of these operations depends on minimizing their impact. Stricter regulations result from this assessment could pave the way for clean extraction methods and set a precedent for responsible resource management. Moreover, collaboration between government agencies, scientists, and indigenous groups is central to the executive. By incorporating traditional ecological knowledge, TEK, with modern scientific research, Canada is fostering a holistic approach to environmental protection that respects both cultural heritage and dignity. In a world increasingly focused sustainable development and change mitigation, Alberta's commitment to evaluating and addressing the toxicity of thenic acids represents a step forward. This decision highlights the potential for scientific innovation to drive positive environmental change, ensuring that future generations inherit a cleaner, clear planet. Contributions to the James T Canada Telescope Canada has also played a crucial role in some of the most exciting space discovery years. Canadian science and instruments, particularly your infrared imager, spectrograph, NIISS, have contributed to major breakthroughs with the Webb Space Telescope, ST. These include identifying the redshift in galaxies, 
uncovering star clusters and detailed spiral galaxies like NGC, SEP. Canada's involvement in these discoveries mirrors contributions made by the United States, highlighting a shared commitment to space exploration and the quest to understand the universe. Advancements in agricultural science. In the field of agriculture, Canadian researchers have made notable strides that support sustainable farming. Recent advancements include improving the quality of corn in the Maritimes, developing new micropropagation techniques for berries, and enhancing pest management networks. These innovations ensure food security and promote environmentally friendly farming practices. Much like the United States efforts in precision agriculture, Canada's contributions demonstrate a dedication to combining technology and science to meet the challenges of modern agriculture. What secrets will Canada reveal next? From ancient petroglyphs and fossilized forests to underwater wonders, meteor craters, and space discoveries, Canada is a treasure trove of scientific revelations. As researchers continue to explore its vast wilderness and ecosystems, who knows what other secrets lie hidden beneath the forests, glaciers, and oceans? Stay curious and join us on this incredible journey of discovery. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more amazing insights from around the globe. Hit the bell icon so you never miss an adventure into the hidden wonders of our world. Let us know in the comments which of these discoveries amazed you the most. Do you think there are more lost treasures waiting to be found in Canada? We'd love to hear your thoughts.